hello guys welcome to the channel so it seems like the city girls boyfriends are beefing right now all because Lil Uzi Vert was talking to Carisha aka Young Miami very rude he was handling her and talking to her very disgusting now, this is not Lil Uzi's first time actually talking to Young Miami like this this is just the first time that Southside has said something to Lil Uzi Vert about it so I'm gonna let you guys go ahead and look at the live where JT and Lil JT and Young Miami was live and JT ended up giving the phone to Lil Uzi. In the DMs with your pussy and I don't play that shit. Is this Carisha? Bro, stop playing me for I embarrass you on this shit. Is this Carisha? Baby, your woman is saying this to you on the um passage. And you know, you know, you know my whole body and soul, and you know I don't give a fuck about nothing. So listen, is this Carisha? Uzi, me and you don't have to be friends. I don't care, Carisha, Carisha, Carisha. That's understood. Carisha, Carisha. Carisha, Carisha. Carisha, it ain't even about that, though. It ain't even about that. Because you know me, I'm going to tell you right now. Carisha, 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 so anyway, Carisha, um, and JT told me, she like, Uzi, you ain't gonna do nothing to make it worse, so don't say nothing, but you know, clearly I run the shit, and this is mine, every, mine, so it's just like, Carisha, oh. shut up, Come, uh, uh, JT, 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 if I tell you, if I told you to kiss me on this live right now, you won't do it, okay, we'll just so we'll just chill, time. hey. You saw what I said to you, Karisha, because you left me on scene. Yeah, because it's like it's understood. Me, you right, not I'm friends, right. and we don't have to be friends. That scene. But it's you... not about that, Karisha. You already. I told you. you know, I ain't gonna say it on live. But I already told you what be wrong with me. Everybody know what be wrong with me. You don't know me like that. Yeah, but know. exactly. I I never did nothing to you. This your second. No, time you didn't know. You see what I said. You see. This you saw the. You saw time. what I said. So oh, at well. this point, at this point, it's just and like it's my okay. last. And, and look, and it's my last time. Like whether you like it or not, it's my last time. I would never do you like that. I'd never ever do you like that. That's not even in me. Like I won't do you like that. What you do to me? Like what you did to me? Honestly, tell me what you did to me. All right, me. baby, I see what you. Want. Relax. What you want I'm not on no weirdo shit. What you did to me? No, I'm just saying like you up there. Yeah, I am. I am up yeah, there, but I'm. I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna go there. I'm. A, you're not getting on live anyway. That's number one. Okay, so Uzi, you could just hang up and we'll talk off the eye because it's a lie. Yeah, because he's gonna. No, I ain't gonna, I'm not gonna yeah. say nothing. I'm just saying you get what I'm saying. Yeah, I get what you're saying. I get All right, what you're I'll saying. talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. Okay. All right. Get off live. All right, Felicia. So I can't even. Summer! Come on. Let me see Summer. JT. What's up? You look real pretty. Thank you. You ain't showing your shirt? Let me see your shirt. What you got on, Rick Owens? Yeah, Rick Owens got whole clothes, girl. <laughs> I got on Rick Owens. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Shout okay, they need a sponsor, you sis. Oh, I, I see nipples. <laughs> <laughs> I got on. All right, that's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Uzi, for real. Come on. No, I ain't going to lie. Okay, okay. Right. Right. Like that. I don't like don't get like that. Okay, okay. It's a 10. We both going to take it to a 5. We're going to take it to a 5. Yeah, we both going to take it. But we going to. But when we go to the room, can we take it to a 11? We can take it to a 12 when we get offline. Can take it to a 20? Okay, y'all say, so y'all can just call me back. All right. I'm going to call. We'll call back. All right. Love you, twin. All right. Bye, Carisha. We love you. Bye-bye. Bye. Yeah. So, yes, and that's why a lot of fans were upset with JT because she allowed her boyfriend to talk to her best friend in such a disgusting manner. Like, to be honest, as a woman, that's your best friend. You should at least tell your dude a chill. Now, she did try, but she said she wasn't going to do all of that because she didn't want people to be on social media like, oh, they're fighting over a phone. She said she wasn't going to cuss him out because she didn't want people to be like, oh, JT is cussing Lil Uzi out. But, sis, I'm just going to say this. You should have tried harder because now this situation then exploded. And by Lil Uzi being a dude, why are you talking to a woman like this? I mean, I'm pretty sure she is taller than you. So here is Young Miami's baby daddy slash boyfriend's response to Lil Uzi Vert disrespecting his girlfriend. Yeah, I'm going to say this one time. Hey, Uzi, don't, don't address none of my... 
You 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 handle your bitch, nigga. You stay on your side and y'all stay on your side. You got one more time to say something. You ain't got one more time to say nothing to my I promise you I'm gonna punch your teeth out your mouth. Don't say nothing else, nigga. Nothing else to my nigga. If you don't like my don't like my who them. I don't get in they shit. We don't get in they problems, nigga. Stay the little weirdo you is, nigga. Keep rocking purses. Keep doing that bitch shit you doing. I ain't with none of that plan, bro. None of that. None of that plan. I'm the same nigga that saved you from getting robbed from offsetting them, nigga. Don't forget that. I'm the same nigga. I was the only nigga in the studio that had blicks on me, nigga. I'm the same nigga that kept you from getting your jury to when Merck's picking up your jury, nigga. Let's not play stupid, my nigga. Stop playing dumb with me, nigga. Don't play stupid at all, bro. Don't play dumb. You feel me? Go on on with that shit, bro. Deal with your bitch. Fuck with your bitch, nigga. And stay with your bitch. That's all I'm gonna say. One time I will slap dog shit out you. I could have slapped dog shit out you at the party the other day. You feel me? You and that motherfucker with security. I don't ride around Miami with security. We ride around Miami with sticks, nigga. That's it. That's how we play. I'm tired of you bitch ass niggas going on this bitch acting like you niggas is tough and you niggas is gangster. You niggas hide up on the niggas from Atlanta, go around niggas in Atlanta, pay niggas, give niggas whatever the fuck they want just so niggas can be around you. I ain't gotta do none of that, nigga. I'm really thugging, nigga. Stop playing with me, nigga. Don't say nothing else to my bitch, nigga. That's my last time saying this shit, nigga. I'm telling you. Or you gonna have a real problem on your hands. Herb can't save you. Mansky can't save you. Watt can't save you. Nobody can't save you. I want my head up, nigga. I want my fade, nigga. You want to box Richard Kid so bad? Come box me, you bitch. So, yeah, we didn't heard a lot of tea that we wasn't even expecting. Like, Offset trying to rob Lil Uzi. Like, what was the point of that? But anyways, Lil Uzi, JT, and Young Miami all tweeted about this situation. And here's what they had to say. Lil Uzi responded and said, I can't do nothing, right? Then that's when JT came after him and said, y'all just like him extra as elf. Please go ahead. Miami said, I'm not sad or crying. Y'all got me effed up. And that's when somebody said, LOL, don't talk to Carisha like that. And that's when Lil Uzi responded and said, that's my girlfriend, best friend. I was playing with her. She always cursed me out. Somebody responded to something that JT said and said, nah, it's just you need to control him. You was a little too calm. And JT responded and said, I wasn't about to give y'all a show. He already was doing it. I put him in his place politely, but you know if... If y'all don't have a story, y'all make one. And JT said, and he was dead ass playing as usual. I just didn't want him talking too much because he was drinking. Shut the F up. I'll delete this stuff and come back when I feel like it. Now, my honest opinion about this whole situation is I don't feel like... I feel like JT is trying to cover up for a little Uzi because he was talking to a friend like that and people was getting on her case. That's the only reason why I feel like she was trying to take up for him because he was being rude and young Miami dude, Southside did exactly what he was supposed to do. He checked the little Uzi. Now you need your man that's gonna check somebody because they talking rude to you because that's exactly what he did and I'm glad that he did. Somebody need to put Lil Uzi Vert in his place. So that's it for the video, guys. I would like to know your thoughts and opinions on this situation down in the comment section. How would you feel if your best friend allowed her man to talk to you like that? That's the question for the comment section. So go ahead and let me know how you feel about that. You guys, go ahead and make sure you like, share, subscribe, and also hit the notification bell. And as always, thanks for watching.